Breast cancer is the primary cause of death for Romanian women. Uterine cancer has a mortality rate over four times higher than the EU average. However, Romania is in the last place in all European rankings when it comes to prevention. In addition to fighting both the disease and the side effects from the treatment, cancer patients are facing lowered quality of life because of stigma. As the feminine beauty standards like hair, breasts or complexion are severely affected by the cancer fight, women are facing social exclusion, shame and depression. So we had a bold goal to make a change in Romanians' perception. Cancer fight doesn't make you less beautiful. On the contrary, it makes you amazingly beautiful. Introducing by far the most beautiful. Real women fighting cancer starred in a glam nude photo shoot by the internationally renowned Romanian photographer Mihaela Noroc, author of The Atlas of Beauty, to tell their stories, true, touching, inspiring stories. Ne e teamă să aflăm că nu suntem perfecte, că nu ne atinge nimic. Ne-am arătat cu mândrie cicatricea pe care o am de la operația care, când mă uit aia, mă duc aminte că am învins. Stories that convince without any doubt that winning the fight with cancer doesn't make women less beautiful. Instead of covering their new short hair with a wig or a scarf, they proudly display it. Instead of hiding their scars, they praise them as they really are, a sign of fighting cancer and winning. In spite of all media roadblocks regarding the photo shoot, the campaign succeeded in over one million people reached in one month through earned media impressions, dozens of pieces of press coverage, huge buzz on social media, other patients felt encouraged to share their own stories. Media Pro, the biggest media trust in Romania, and Biz Magazine voluntarily joined the campaign. The campaign inspired Romanian women, and Medisprof Cancer Center saw a huge rise in appointments in the following months. The website traffic doubled. Google brand-related searches increased by 126%. In a country that lacks prevention programs, all of this was possible with a budget of only 2,000 euro. Cancer doesn't have to mean death. And we will continue the fight together.